like someone is not going to make this easy for me. Mitsunari, what are you planning? Why are you here? Dark Stone! You didn't! I should have expected the great Tenkai be able to figure it out. Why you? Ah, Tenkai and old Jubei. You stand in the way of our world domination. Such pests. Your interference bothers me.
to his companions. History is riddled with the waves of destruction and revolt. These waves roll onward far into the future. Much has been destroyed. Many have perished.
clash of warring states. Nobunaga had attempted to unite the lands under his rule using the Genma. However, the Onimusha were able to halt his blind ambition. Nobunaga perished amidst the flames at Honoji Temple. The massive army of Genma that had plagued the land vanished. After Nobunaga's demise, his retainer Hideyoshi Toyotomi united Japan. It seemed that he had finally put a stop to the fear and panic that came with the age of warring states, bringing a much welcomed peace. However, June 29th, 1596. Overnight, the omen star appeared in the sky. That day, Hideyoshi was overcome by a mysterious change, and Japan was once again thrown into chaos. The repeated massacres on the continent. The slaughter of everyone on board the captured western ship San Felipe the banishment of foreigners, and the executions of holy men. A tempest rages through the land yet again under Hideyoshi. Meanwhile, a great earthquake rocks Fushimi Castle in Kyoto. In its wake, other catastrophes wreak havoc across Japan. The peace is shattered, and nothing is left untouched. As if called forth by the terror brewing in human hearts, Genma begin to reappear, slaughtering all in their path, bringing panic and despair to the world. Fifteen ninety-eight, mocking the destruction of the world. The omen star appears, shining bright in the heavens, foreshadowing something sinister. Minokichi. Yep. Are you ready? Yep, I'm fully prepared. We're going to do this just like we planned. Right. Young one, what business do you have? <laughs> oh, great and noble warrior. I beseech you to spare your precious time and listen to my humble request. <laughs> Cute. You may speak. Would you just drop the goods and go home? What did you say? Ruffian, you do know these belong to Lord Hideyoshi. Right, Lord Hideyoshi. Leave the cherry trees where they are and I might let you live, Danyemon. How did you know my name? I've spilled the blood of countless enemies. You shall pay for your insolence! <laughs> Please, you don't stand a chance against me. Leave him to me. The rest of you, take this to the fortress in Suruga. 
sorry. I'm afraid not. <laughs> Guess you won't be going that way, huh? Are you going to head back? Challenge me. Hmm? Ugh, it reeks. Hey, you didn't eat the bugs, did you? A present from my lord. These bugs give me the ability to fight, and I have had my fill. The more of them I eat, the stronger I become. So, you did eat them. Well, I guess that means I have to kill you. You know too much, thief. You've made yourself a dangerous enemy. Prepare for a painful death. You know my name. Now it is time to tell me your... My name, eh? My name is none of your concern! Genma into the world once again. A man wielding two tremendous broadswords has appeared with a mission to hunt the Genma down. He cuts down any of the vicious Genma and burns down all of the twisted characters that he finds. He fights like the owner and leaves a swath of burnt cherry trees in his path. So he has received the name Sophie, meaning only of the last. Inspiring all reminiscent of the Oni, he cuts through darkness with his gigantic blade, showing his enemy no mercy. Why does he fight? What drives him to burn the cherry trees down? Nobody knows. My name is Soki, the Oni of the Ash. I wish you better luck in the next life, Danyemon. Minokichi. Yeah? Get ready. All right. just dispatched the infested Danimo with ease. He must be the blue demon that's destroying Lord Hideyoshi's trees. Quite formidable. But he's not my problem. Should I kill him anyway? It's... it's him. I finally found him. What? <sighs> 
What a coincidence. The Blue Demon is famous for being a traitor to Lord Hideyoshi. If that's the case, maybe I shouldn't be so quick to cut him down. It looks like we need to find another batch of cherry trees. Time to go. The only way to do it. I know. Was incredible, Master Soki! Oh, just incredible! Maybe so, but all this business with the trees has me feeling tired. You can relax here at the hideout. Plan for your next battle while you rest up. That's not all you can do here either. There's lots of ways you can get ready. If you have any questions, you know who to ask. Me! I think I'll call it a day for now. That's a good idea. You never know when the next battle will begin. Don't wet the bed, alright kid? I won't! The smell of death is thick here. Then again. The smell of death is everywhere these days. <laughs> Hold on, princess. Where might you be going? Don't be in such a hurry. Pour us a drink! <laughs> Come on now. We're nice guys. <laughs> got you! <laughs> the blue demon? I heard that he has been spotted along this road. <laughs> you better remember me! I pour drinks for no man! Little. Ugh. Master Soki! Something wicked is quickly approaching! In great numbers, no less! Are there trees? There are none! <sighs> Then that's our cue to hide. Yes, but it seems there's a human close to their position. Oh, probably just a lost bandit. Leave him. No, the human appears smaller, like a child, and it's alone! What? What would a child be doing out here? Guess we just can't sit around and hide. Where's the human? The back road!
barricade here. They just call me the Blue Demon. Now it's my turn to ask who you are. And why are you in a place like this alone? I don't need to tell you. Prepare to die, Demon. Watch it! Listen to me! I only showed up to help you! A monster helping me? I think not. Ah, the Yagyusego style. You're full of surprises. Nogi, time is run! What's your name? Uh, Jubei. Jubei Yagyu. Jubei? The Jubei Yagyu? Have a problem with that? And you should state your own name before asking mine. Oh, of course. Sorry. Name! Name. Well, I don't really have one. If I had one to give, Soki would be it. That's what everyone calls me. You're an odd one. I'm not the only one. I was born with this. Ooh, Master Soki! We <gasps> have time! <laughs> what the? Very friendly. Get back. You're not gonna be of any help anyway. They're Genma. No human blade can kill them. Oh, is that oh. Over there! Take him down!
Come back! How can he kill the Genma? The only thing that can kill them is the Yaku sword. Are you okay? I'm fine! You just worry about the Genma and the fridge! What are you doing? Take them down! I'm leaving it to you. Come back. Ah, uh, all done.
Take him down! Over there! All done? Come back! Got it! Over there. Uh, all done. Take him down!
stay over there. Come back! Come back!
Take him down! Come back! Sata Pass? That's right, Sata Pass. I heard rumors of cherry trees popping up there suddenly. Hmm, sounds interesting. I have business there anyway, with a man. What do you think of that? What do I think? I'm just saying that since I'm headed there, we could check on the rumors. Did you hear that? It's our lucky day! Don't startle me like that, kid! It's a miracle! 
This is the chance we've been waiting for, Master Soki! Are you floating or hanging on a hook or what? Is that thread? Can I touch it? Ah! Oh! Tickle! 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 <laughs> Stop! Oh, please, don't touch that! <sighs> don't, don't touch my thread! <laughs> I get all excited about this! Oh, it's just shameful! <laughs> so, sorry. Take me to this place you speak of, Jubei. I'm tired of this waiting. Yeah? Really? You just leave it to me. So what's this business you have there? I already told you. There's a man I need to see there. Is this an assassination? Don't worry. You don't need to tell me the details. Time to set out for Sata Pass. How do you plan to get past security? That place is likely to be well guarded. It won't be easy. Don't worry. I know the perfect place to scout the area from. Well, why didn't you mention that sooner? We'll formulate a plan there. Let's go. What should we do? I'll draw the riffraff out while you make your way inside. Soki is joined by a girl by the name of Jubei. Together they prepare to attack the fortress at Suruga. A large number of cherry trees are gathered there. The man that Jubei seeks also awaits.
to keep you waiting, Blue. <sighs> I was just getting bored. Come on. Take him down!
Put those swords. Watch the fun. Could you come here? Fine, Knock fine. Cold. Gotcha.
be so hasty. You'll get your meat soon enough. It looks like the blue demon is finally here. And you are? I am the man that cuts down anyone that defies the Lord. You're quick. And you're far too quick to use that giant broadsword of yours. The Yagyu technique, and that style, the reverse. Hm. Seems like I keep running into Yagyu's today. Impressive. You know the reverse fencing style. I should have known the son of Ieyasu would. Well, the illegitimate son, anyway. <laughs> I've never been much for fighting. Found you! I finally found you, Uncle. Munanori! I said, I've never been much for fighting. Trees should be up ahead. Torch them before they get away. This one will taste my bleed. I was starting to wonder who the other intruder was. To think it was you, Akane. The old man picked you to be my assassin. How ironic. <laughs> Jubin, be careful. He won't be defeated that easily. Just go on! I have to take him down myself. But don't interfere! All right. I'll be waiting. Just be careful. I have no business with you. <sighs> this is fun. Just like our old training days, Akane. Draw your weapon, Munanori. I don't need my sword for the likes of you. Quit playing! Demon-eyed witch! Don't look at me! With that eye! I should have known it was you. Oh, Hatsu! I said don't move! You've become quite a lovely woman. Feisty, too! A blue demon popping up in Suruga and burning Lord Hideyoshi's cherry trees. Once the winds brought the rumor to Osaka, I knew it had to be you. Guess I'm famous now. Stop joking! Come back with me to Osaka. If you come back now, I'm sure Lord Hideyoshi will forgive you. Then it will be just like it used to be, fighting for... That's not going to happen. Why do you have to interfere with Lord Hideyoshi's plans? Why are you after the trees? Interfering, huh? You could say that with a straight face, even after knowing what those trees are? <laughs> Look with your eyes. See what is going on all around you! I call this a cherry tree, and this, or this, all of this! Hideyoshi now is not the man I once knew. Even so, Lord Hideyoshi is your... Exactly! That's why it's up to me. You don't understand. Lord Hideyoshi is the ruler of the land. Everything in Japan is his. It all belongs to the Toyotomi clan now. No! I refuse! What do you think you're going to accomplish alone? One man taking on the whole country? You don't have a chance! I know I don't have a chance. But I can't just quit without even putting up a fight. Don't do anything stupid. 
just come back with me. If you come back to Lord Hideyoshi, you won't have to worry about anything. Even That's if the world not living. and the it's in, you I could live in peace. I refuse to let others choose my path for me. I control my own destiny. You've seen the times we live in. Nobody controls their own destiny anymore! The path I walk is not something that changes with the times. Please. Just listen. I... Even now... I want to be with you. It has already been decided! The Yoshi will meet my blame! Go by that name. Yoshi, or whether I can't. That's something that I can only know for sure if I go to him. Japan is finally unified, and peace is restored. Even the wars were better than this. The people of this country are suffering. Hideyasu. Ohatsu, come with me. Come with me now. Oh, that is quite enough. I can't let you be trying to steal my woman away. <laughs> Not that anything could ever take her away from me. <laughs> what did you do with Jubei? What an excellent question. Why don't you go and find out? <laughs> The naughty little child has been disciplined. <laughs> Prepare the trees. We ride. Hmm? What is it? The child is waiting. I don't think she has much time left. What a terrible brood. What? Of course. 
If you would prefer to stay with your precious trees, I can keep you company. I'll warn you though, I'm one enemy you don't want to make. <laughs> Run, demon! Run with all your might! Stupid! Poor Hideyasu! Don't worry! I'll take care of the preparations for one hell of a blossoming festival! Alive. Why? <sighs> Soki, were you able to get all the trees? I can get to them later. Fool, you left the trees. This trip was a waste. Why did you bother saving me? It just wasn't your time to go yet. Kyoto. You 
can kill him there. While I kill Hideyoshi. We're not far from Kyoto now. Let's rest here for the night. <sighs> I haven't walked this much in ages. I'm pooped. Munanori certainly set us straight, eh, Kichi? Plans for the Daigo Blossoming Festival are progressing. Our tree hunting didn't do much good after all, huh? I suppose the only thing we can do is to attack Hideyoshi directly. It would have come to this sooner or later anyway. If we make it to Fushimi Castle, we will locate Hideyoshi! The least I can do is be a thorn in his side before I die. Master Soki! Don't be so gloomy, you two! Come on, cheer up! Don't call me gloomy. Don't let it get to you, Soki. I don't know what's gonna happen at the Daigo Flower Party. But I know one thing. I'll stop Muninori. And you? You've got to find Hideyoshi and take him apart. Got it? Must be nice to be so flippant about everything. What is it? We're not far from Kyoto now. Let's go. Wow, Kyoto. You know, I was born and raised in the Yagi village. This will be my first time in a big city. I bet the food's great there. I'm getting really excited now that we're close. We're going there to fight, Jubei. I know, I know! Such a dark soul. Such power. I must admit that I am interested indeed. Who are you? How did you get in here? <laughs> Let's just stop at the introductions. For now. Hey! Where are you going? What on earth are you doing, Soki? Why are you yelling over there all by yourself? You didn't see a man dressed from head to toe in white? He was right here. There was no one here. Right, Kichi? I saw no one. Only I can see him? What could this mean? Jubei, this isn't Kyoto, it's Sawayama. There's not much we can do. Kyoto lies beyond it. Hideyoshi has gathered the cherry trees to hold the Dark Blossoming Festival. 
Soki and Jubei set out to Kyoto to the start time. After many days of traveling, the two finally arrive at Sawayama in Omi province. Over there! Go! 
Gotcha! I'm leaving it to you. Come back. I'm leaving it to you. Gotcha. Stay over there! Gotcha! Come back! Gotcha! Die! I'm leaving it to you! Yeah! 
Come back! Stay over there! Come back! Stay over there! Take him down! Stay over there!
know you're not just some poor lost samurai wandering around here. Say something! Did you do this? Why didn't you kill me? Something in my blood stopped me! That Jubei just now was an illusion! Perceptive. Who are you? Another time.
over there! Uh-huh. Relax, Jubei. The two Oni are united. Seki Shusai Yagyu's granddaughter. You have the demon eye, Akane Yagyu. You knew my grandfather? Just who are you anyway? And the Black Oni. I'm also known as the Blue Demon, but call me Soki. My name is Tenkai Nankobo. I've been journeying to put a stop to Hideyoshi and his Genma by finding the bearers of the Oni spirit. We finally meet, Oni Warriors. Oni, holders of a most terrifying power, humanity's last hope. You said you were on a quest to crush the Genma's ambition, didn't you? Yes. However, although you two have Oni blood coursing in your veins, you are not yet powerful enough to face the Genma. I shall lend you my services. But who are you? How do you know about the Oni? You'll find out soon enough, my child. But first, there's a man we must rescue. 
Who? He's a Westerner. They call him Roberto. Mitsunari Ishida is holding him captive in Sawayama Castle. I suppose he's an honorary member of the Oni clan, too. Not quite. But he should be able to help put an end to Hideyoshi and the Genma. In fact, I doubt we stand a chance without Roberto. Sounds like you're questioning our ability. At any rate, Sawayama Castle is probably heavily guarded. The Genma we fought before left a tunnel leading straight to the castle. We'll use that. Let's hurry before the entrance is sealed. State your business. State your business. State your business. What do you need, Master Soki? Has the time come to move out? All right then, we're off to Sawayama Castle. We've got to save that Westerner, Roberto, right? Precisely. Unfortunately, however, I doubt our progress has gone unnoticed by Mitsunari. Our best bet is to draw his attention to the town so we can attempt a rescue. We'll need a decoy. Jubei, I'd like you to do it. Me? Act as bait? No way, mister. I want to go too. Jubei. You're faster than any of us. When I first saw your body move like the wind, I was amazed. <laughs> really? Hmm. You've got to use your quickness to occupy the Genma. This is nothing you can't handle. In fact, I don't think anyone else could do this as well as you. <laughs> Seriously? Well, I guess if you put it that way. Well, I guess I always have been pretty confident about my speed. I've got a good body for it and all. Grandpa always said, even I couldn't move as swiftly as you when I was young. He really said that. So, I guess I am the best for decoys and diversions and stuff. They can throw all the Genma they want at me. I'll just shut them off and run like the wind. It'll be no problem. A piece of cake. <laughs> Soki. Huh? Soki. Well? If you're going out there as our decoy, we can rest easy knowing it'll really go smoothly. We can just concentrate on the rescue. It's settled then. Just leave the decoy work to me. You two relax. Take your time rescuing that guy. The time has come. Let's move. Good luck. You're good with kids. Hey, I've been around a long time, my friend. What kind of guy is this Roberto, anyway? I don't know, but we're on the lookout for a Westerner.
The Samurai Tenkai is on a quest. He is trying to find the successor who carries the Oni blood, so that Hideyoshi and the Genma can be vanquished. Tenkai senses the power of the Oni coursing through Soki and Jubei, and decides to continue his journey with them.
Let's go. We'll do. Take a break. Go. We'll do. Take a break.
Come here. You're Roberto, aren't you? We're here to rescue you. Do you understand what I'm saying? Este lugar solía gustarme. Esta vez te la has cargado. Where do you think you're going? Debo matar a Frois. No intentes detenerme. He said he's going to kill Frois, so don't get in his way. Hold on. Let's let's at least work together. Quieres morir? What the hell are you doing? Maldición! No tengo tiempo para eso. Si me obligas, te mataré. I don't think I need a translation for that. I didn't just bust you free for the fun of it. I don't care how tough you are. I'll make you listen. Good, but no killing. We need him. Huh? I'm 
not about to fight someone unarmed. Here. No necesito esos juguetes mortales. Fine. Do what you want. But I'm not going to hold back. You don't give up easily. Maldita sea! Japones! Ese sonido. Se acercan problemas. Vosotros, ocupaos de eso. Primero debo matar a Frois. Uh, wait! Looks like this is up to us. Great guy you found for us. Lord Sakonshima? He's Mitsunari Ishida's retainer. This is not good. Stand firm. The slightest hesitation and he will kill you.
looks like we're not going anywhere. Hideyasu, are you there? Oh, Hatsu! I have something I need to ask you. Hideyasu, climb up first. Lord Mitsunari! What is it? Luis Froyce is here to see you. Let him in. Yes, sir. I... I can't get used to it being called Luis Froyce! You better get used to it. That name is our insurance. Anyway, are the preparations at Daigo Temple complete? <laughs> yes, yes, things are going as planned. We only need the Genma trees now. The gathering of the trees appears to be going well. Lord Claudius? I have gathered the number of trees you have requested. The trees that the Oni have destroyed are of no concern. It should not interfere with our plans. I look forward to the Daigo Blossoming Festival. <laughs> they, they, they won't be caught in that trap long. <laughs> yes, I imagine they are on their way now. Ah, or should I say, they are here. The Black Oni's second coming. I'm really looking forward to meeting him. I do so hope I can rend him to pieces with his very hands! Oh, have you had any word from Ophelia? N -n nothing new. She, she is still keeping watch over Idios. Hmm, it looks like everything is falling into place. Yeah, yeah, yes, indeed. The Omen Star grows brighter with all the trees that we gather. Our destiny has almost been realized. <laughs> <laughs> hey! This was a trap? No. I just wanted to be alone with you. Hideyasu, we have to talk. Tell me, what is Lord Hideyoshi doing with those cherry trees? Why do they look like people? Why are they crying? Hideyasu, please tell me. You must know. Mitsunari seems to be in charge of gathering those trees. And he was calling them Genma trees. What is a Genma tree? Genma trees are... humans. A twisted mass of human bodies. I can't believe it. The trees are just a device to produce the Genma insects. Those insects are then used to control people. Genma insects? Anybody that is under the control of them becomes a powerful soldier. Who knows no fear. No hunger. And will fight to the death to complete their mission. The soldiers being sent from Kyushu over to the continent then are... Yes, exactly. Once under the control of the insect, the person loses their soul and becomes an abomination of nature. An abomination. Hideyoshi is gathering the Genma trees from all over Japan for the Daigo Blossoming Festival in order to release all of the insects at once and transform everyone in Japan into a mindless drone. That's... Impossible! Hatsu... Come with me. Just like the old days. I 
believe in you. I always did. And I always will. Mitsunari is the one behind the Genma trees. He is in the castle now. If you could kill him, then maybe Lord Hideyoshi will return to his senses. If that's what it takes, then let's go! Hideyasu, what about your companion? Just leave him. He'll be fine. Ohatsu! All right, let's get moving.
Take him down! Yes. Hatsu. Over there! Take a break. Take him down! Yes.
wonderful work, Ohatsu. It's been a long time, Hideyasu. Onenori. Ohatsu. I knew it was a trap! No, I didn't. Come here, Ohatsu. What's wrong? You weren't going to betray me, were you now? Munenori. It was your job to bring Hideyasu back to his senses. You weren't going to join his rebellion against our lord now, were you? You're quite devious. But not devious enough, I'm afraid. <laughs> now, don't make me jealous. You haven't forgotten, have you? I hold your life in my hands. <laughs> you should realize that by now. What's he talking about? Shall we let our guest in on it? <laughs> yes, that's right. You're so precious. Ohatsu! Ohatsu's mine. Keep your hands off her, lover boy. <laughs> I hate swords. But now I have no choice. I told you before, I'm one enemy you don't want to make.
quite a warrior. I have watched you grow since you were a child. Quit the formalities. I only have one question for you. Are you the one who was controlling Hideyoshi? Answer me! I am afraid not. Lord Hideyoshi is quite capable of making up his own mind. Why not go and find out for yourself? I'm quite sure that he would be thrilled to see you again. Has Hideyoshi sunk so low? Luis! Ah! My experiment has escaped from his cage! meet him again at Fushimi by Daigo Temple. Lord Hideyoshi will be there to join us as well. No corres de mi! Cobarde! Die! 
Nuestra misión es detener a Hideyoshi y a esos condenados bastardos de Genma. Y seguro que pronto nos toparemos con ese Luis Froyce que andas buscando. ¿Quieres que luche a vuestro lado? Necesitamos el poder de tu cofre. ¿Sabes lo de mi cofre? Soki, listen. Tenka is speaking that foreign language perfectly. Is there anything that white-haired monk can't do? Bueno, pero te lo abierto. Tan solo voy detrás de Luis Froyce. No esperes que obedezca tus órdenes. Está bien. Soki, Jubei, Roberto here has expressed an interest in joining our little group. Are you serious? Why not, Soki? He seems nice. I'm Jube Yagyu. Nice to meet you. Is this guy shy or what? Here, you forgot this book. He is shy. I knew it. State your business. State your business. that the Daigo Blossoming Festival is drawing near. I say we just head straight to Kyoto. Is that okay, Tenkai? Of course. I sense evil coming from the city, and, and it's growing stronger. It'll take more than that to frighten me off. I'm going to put a stop to this little party and exact revenge on Hideyoshi. And I'm going after Muninori. Luis. Wait. I know that each of you has a specific goal in mind here, but we cannot lose sight of what's important. Our first order of business must be to destroy the source of the cherry. No, the Genma trees. The Genma mother tree. If we cannot fell that tree, we have no chance of emerging from this battle victorious. Is that clear? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Good. When we reach the capital, we must first head to the Akechi tomb. The Akechi tomb? What's that? It is where my master lies sleeping. It is also the place from where I sought an opportunity to destroy the Mother Tree and keep watch over Fushimi Castle. The power of the Oni is strong there. No Genma dare draw near it. I see. That should be an excellent spot from which to stage our attack. We'll head for the Akechi tomb immediately. Hideyoshi, I'm coming for you. I'll see to it that this nightmare ends. To the capital!
We'll be spotted if we stay together. Let's split up. Regroup at the entrance to Daigo Temple. I was just getting bored. Come on.
Glad to see you're all okay. Ah. Mm. Hideyoshi lies beyond this gate. But first, we must put a stop to the festival. We must burn the Genma Mother Tree in order to destroy the other trees. Forget! We're after the Genma Mother Tree! Dios castigalo! I knew you would return uh, my vicious uh, experiment! <laughs> what would you like me to do to you next, eh, Akane? Bastard! <laughs> Lord Hideyoshi is waiting at the top for you. Soki! Not yet! Leave him to me! I will destroy him by myself! You cannot fight alone and expect to win! He's too powerful! Psycho! Don't be rude, Tenkai. Let Lord Hideyoshi and Hideyasu have their reunion. Psycho will entertain you while you wait. <laughs> Soki! You can't beat Hideyoshi yet! Kyoto, Daigo Temple. Amidst the falling cherry blossoms, the Daigo Blossoming Festival is about to begin.
I was just getting bored. Come on. It has been a long time, Hideyasu. For me too, my liege. I have so wanted to see you again, son. What an exciting compliment to this fine festival. Mitsunari. Not yet. I saw that. I saw that. 
Control you. Are you truly a samurai warrior? Then I. I. Well, well. It looks like Sakon is going to need a little more work. I have so wanted to see you again, son. What wonderful timing, Hideyasu blowing in on the wind with the lovely cherry blossoms, causing quite a commotion here with your friends. Look, you have upset your little brother Hideyori, right, Yodo? <laughs> Truly, quite rude. My liege, do you truly find the cherry blossoms lovely? Of course I do. They are my first step to the Toyotomi clan's domination of the world. If they are not lovely, I do not know what is. Hideyasu, now that you have returned to Osaka, stand with me. By my side, we can help Hideyori rule over this world. My liege, stop the invasion. Do not turn your back on the lives of your own people or the people of other lands. What you speak is nonsense, Hideyasu. I am the country. The Toyotomi clan is Japan. I am fit to rule over this world. It is filled with ignorant human animals, nothing more than beasts. The fate of everything down to a single blade of grass is under my control. Why should I care about the lives of the rabble inhabiting my world? Hideyoshi. You have turned to evil after uniting this land. <clears throat> the pitiful Genma trees, the foreign hell. All of it is just a game to you. All of it. Just for your gain! Oh, quite a performance. <laughs> Cunning, just like your real father. Hideyasu, stop! How many have died? Overseas. And here in Japan. All for your blind ambition! Hideyoshi. You ended the era of warfare that plagued this land. Now your people suffer more than ever! Is that your answer? Worthless garbage! Hideyoshi, you will die by my hand. Show me your black power, Oni!
你。Such a powerful asset die, Hideyasu. Return to me. Place your black power in my service, and your life will be spared. It's your only choice. I control my own destiny. What? The path I walk is my choice alone. Wretched fool! You will do as I command. By my grace, all life is decided. If I say fight, you will fight. If I say die, you will die. My path. That is the path that the Japanese people now walk. <sighs> Didn't you know? Humans are free. Whether we die or whether we live, that is for each one of us to decide. Then it appears that the great Hideyasu has decided to die. If that's what it takes to stop you, so be. This is where you will fall.
Loki! Head to Mount Hie! Mount Hie? Rise above humanity! Rise above the Oni! Become the Oni Musha! Destroyer of evil! You are the holder of the most terrifying power! Humanity's last hope! Hideyasu Yuki! Well done. Well done. The bothersome distraction is over, and the festival is now at its peak. <laughs>
Stay over there! Back me up! Stay over there! Yeah. me up. Ohatsu, we're almost there. Mount Hiei, uh, just a little... Ohatsu, what is it? Ohatsu! I'm... sorry. Oh. Hideyasu. Get my insects! But how? Uh, Why? They were most likely placed there to prevent her from betraying the Toyotomi! Uh, is this why you were following Munenori? I knew this would happen when I made the decision to come with you. Then why? Why did you come? I had to. It is the destiny I decided for myself. Damn. This is all my fault. Why? It's not your fault. This is the path I chose to walk. No! Minokichi, can we do anything for her? We have to deal with Final Blow before she becomes a Genma tree. I can't! You know I can't do that! I'm afraid there's no other way! If you want to save the girl, there is another way. You're okay for now, but you only have about two more hours. I'll take her with me. Hey! Wait! If you care about her, come to the temple! There's no time to waste! Ohatsu! Was that...? I don't believe she was Genma. Rather, I would like to think she was an ally. Whoever she is, let's head for the temple. I'll do whatever it takes to save Ohatsu! Thank you. 
Way you mentioned there is 
Only one way. It sleeps inside of you. You must awaken your true power. Transform into the Oni Musha. Enter and retrieve the Oni Orb that lies within. You must return before the gate closes. Then you will be an Oni Musha. Whether you believe me or not, that is the only way to save this poor girl. There is not much time. What is your choice?
You're finished! You're finished!
interesting eye. You Oh. 
For. There is nothing controlling you anymore. Ohatsu, you are free. Hideyasu. I mean, Soki. I will always be by your side. feeling again. It seems as though you have awoken the Onimusha inside you, Black Oni. Who are you? Who am I? That's a silly question. We are linked very closely together, you and I. What are you talking about? The grand conclusion will bring us together, Black Oni. You have power rivaling the God of Darkness. We shall meet soon. The God of Darkness? Hey, Soki! Soki! Ah, it's you, Arin. It's you, Arin? Is your head screwed on right? Of course it is. Didn't you see the man dressed in white just now? Oh, he's gone. I wonder if he's one of them. It's not likely. This place is filled with Oni magic. A Genma could not come within a mile of here. Just my imagination, then. What about Ohatsu? Yes, I don't see her. Where is she? Her clothes were destroyed in that battle you two had. She's changing into something else now. <laughs> what are you smiling about? <laughs> You'll see. Come on in, Ohatsu! What do you think, Soki? Oh! Uh, honey! We know what's on your mind now! You are styling, Master Ohatsu! Thank you, Minokichi. Uh... Um... Well, the clothes I was wearing were shredded to pieces. So I used what I could with some clothes Arin gave me to make this. I'm a little embarrassed, but... What do you think, Soki? <laughs> what do I think? Uh, they look great. <laughs> Good.
good. Pick your job off the floor, Soki. Well, anyway, your old ones were awfully cumbersome, so these should make it much easier to fight the Genma. I wore those baggy clothes to try and hide what the Genma insects were doing to my body. Thanks to Soki, I don't have to worry about that anymore. Good! Before you go off and try fighting any Genma, you'll need your rest, Ohatsu. You must be tired from your transformation as well, Soki. So you two should rest up! Already time to go? Soki, there's an aerogram for you. Aerogram? What's that? It's when a letter is attached to an arrow and shot. For me? Who's it from? Okay, it says... Uh, ha ha ha, how are you noble Hideyasu? I'm doing wonderful. Munanori? It continues. I know you're probably cowering somewhere in fear. I was going to go and meet you, but some powerful spell kept me out. I do so miss you and would love to have a chat. That's why I sent this aerogram. I was worried just one might get lost, so I prepared 500. Did you hear that? A whole 500. When I woke up, the mountain looked like a pincushion. Now I'm going to have to re-roof the whole place. What a moron! No kidding. Come to the remains of Azuchi Castle. I have Akane. If I don't see you soon, I'm afraid terrible things might happen. I'll be waiting. Signed, Munenori Mataemon Yagyu. Akane? He means Master Jubi! Master Soki! Damn that Munenori! That's one of your friends, right? Let's go. Yes, to Azuchi Castle! At Daigo Temple, following a battle of life and death, the defeated Jubei is taken away by her mortal enemy, Munenori. She is being held hostage at what's left of Azuchi Castle.
up a hornet's nest. Take him down! You're done! Over there! You're spinning!
Take a break. Gotcha. Take a break. Got it. All right, let's get moving. Will do. Back me up. Yes.
You're finished! Stay over there! Yes. Back me up! Like my gun? Take a break. All right, let's get moving. Fine, fine. Take a break.
over there. Let's go. Yes. Stay over there. Come back! Yes. Stay over there! Yes.
faster than I expected. Jubei! Good to see you alive! <gasps> Why did you come, you fool? You didn't think I would leave you. You're my precious. You're precious? What? Oh, that is just about enough, Hideyasu. Have you forgotten that she's still my hostage? <laughs> then it looks like I'll have to get her back, Mune Nori. Ah! <laughs> <sighs> it's dead. How could you? Oh, hello, Ohatsu. What happened to your little pest problem? Shouldn't you be dead by now? <laughs> what pests? It looks like I'm not your little pet anymore! There was a way to remove them? Hmm. Oh well. I was tired of you anyway. I'll finish the job they started. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. May you serve as well as the other twelve before you. Or... Was it 13? <laughs> Sword fighting. I do so hate it. Back me up. Nothing left to throw at us. <laughs> Fool! Oh, but I do. I've been saving it for just such an occasion. Watch out! His eye! Ah. <laughs> yes, I too possess the demon eye!
Akane, I will kill Seiki Shusai and destroy the Yagyu. Just wait! Arin, how does Jubei look? She was pretty weak, but she just needed a good meal and a solid night of rest. She is back to full health. Hey, Blue! Jubei Yagyu is back in action! That was fast. Oh, it looks like you found some more people since last time. People call me Ohatsu. Pleased to meet you. Ohatsu, got it! Nice to meet you! I'm Arin. I was here guarding Mount Hiei with Tenkai. It's wonderful to see you back on your feet, Master Jubei! Whew! I was almost six feet under. Have your wounds healed properly? My head still hurts. That stupid crow of Munenori's kept pecking at it. I'm glad that's all that happened. Western Hospital in Osaka. Correct! Of course, its real name is the San Espana. It appears a Westerner with tattoos on his arms has been taken there. Sounds like Roberto. Well, he must be okay if he's in a hospital then. Wait, Soki. Something about the name San Espana. Oh no! Luis Froyce! Soki and Ohatsu? No, not at all. <laughs> I know how you feel. I'm jealous when I see them too. In my case, it's because the one I'm thinking about never seems to notice me. You're talking about Tenkai, aren't you? Oh, fine. Come right out and say it. Anyway, what are your feelings towards Soki? Blue? Well... He's an important ally, and like a brother to me. So, it's probably not true love, but just a crush or something. Hmm, I don't know. You're so naive. You're one to talk. Jubei! Jubei, we have to hurry to Osaka. We found Roberto. Right. Soki? Yeah? Pay more attention to your little sister. Poor thing. She's so confused right now. Ah! Arin! What? Incredible power in your arms! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Come back! Gotcha! I was just getting bored. Come on.
Nicely again, Luis. <laughs> Where should I begin? Ah! I will cut you to pieces. Now come cold. Right.
Roberto away from here. I can only control the Genma Rosencrantz and his body for so long. Go now! Uh, uh. Roberto's been asleep for ten days now. Yeah. I'm quite worried. His body is a mess after his insides were toyed with like that. It's a wonder he's still alive at all. I'll watch over him. Everybody, wake up! Roberto's finally up! Roberto, can you hear me? Yeah. Are you hungry? Want something? No. I'm so glad you're back. You all saved me. Of course we did. You're one of us. We wouldn't abandon you. I see. Don't worry about it. Wait. Roberto. Can you speak Japanese? Yeah. I'm sorry to keep it from you. Really, I... No, that's okay. We can ask later. Yeah. You've just regained consciousness. You have quite the will to survive. Your body is still banged up. So slow down for a while. <sighs> is something wrong with my face? No. No. Nothing. You're back on your feet already? What a body! Yes, I've taken too much time already. Well, you were injured pretty badly. It can't be helped. After what you went through, you're lucky to be alive at all. Besides, it was a good chance for us to rest too. The Genma have been awfully quiet lately! I'm going to Sawayama Castle. Sawayama Castle? Yes. When I was being held there, I left something very important behind. I need to get it back. I'll be back soon enough, so just wait here. Why? What do you mean, why? If you're going, we're going. Everybody ready to go to Sawayama? We certainly know the way well now. Should be a breeze. We should split up. Otherwise, Mitsunari might notice our presence. Not a bad idea. Hold on. I'm just going back to pick something up. You don't need to get involved. Roberto, if the shoe was on the other foot, would you just wave goodbye when I headed off to Sawayama Castle? <sighs> That's what friends are for. Anyway, let's get going. All right. Roberto wakes up after being unconscious for more than 10 days. He recovers his strength and quickly returns to perfect health. He sets out for the dungeon beneath Sawayama in order to retrieve something valuable left behind while he was being held prisoner there. 
After finally being reunited, his companions are not about to leave his side. Soki and the others accompany Roberto to the place of the great battle, Sawayama. Take him down! Ah, Roberto! Let's go! I was just getting bored. Come on.
You're finished! Let's go. Let's go.
We're home! Welcome back. Did Roberto find what he was looking for? Thank you for asking. I did. We also took a few Genma down along the way. Sounds like you've been busy. Take a breather. We must stop Hideyoshi. The country is filling with Genma as we speak. But what can we do? They'll just repel us again. That was no ordinary power he had. I know Soki has reawakened the Onimusha, but I'm afraid it still won't be enough. Underneath it all, Hideyoshi is still just a man. There must be something supplying him with that much power. Let's head to Sakai. Sakai? In Osaka? Right. There is a place called the Toyokuni Research Facility. It is where Genma research is being carried out under the command of Mitsunari and Luis Royce. It might be just what we need to find the source of Hideyoshi's power. Exactly. The pendant you helped me to recover is actually a key to the inside of the building. How did you end up with that? I was raised with my friends by Luis. The facility was our home when we were young. There are two facilities though. One in Osaka, and the other in Kyushu. We traveled back and forth between them with Luis. We have a lot of work to do. Then let's go to the... Uh, Toyokuni Research Facility. Right! The Toyokuni Research Facility. Touch anything! Bye. Free the dark stone. Gather the Ganma trees. Neutralize the exorcising beads. Revive the triumvirate. Claudius, Rosencrantz, Ophelia. Control Hideyoshi. Appearance of the Omen Star. Revive the God of Light. Expel the humans. Could you read it? Yes. There was some written here and there that I could pick up. What did you learn? Their plan. From the parts I could read. It is a terrifying one. Tell us! Yes. I will, but later. First we have to destroy Hideyoshi's source of power. Source of power? Yes. The large dark stone. It's where he draws his strength. Where is it? Underground. There should be a passage that leads down there. Oh. the Toyokuni Research Facility in Sakai, Osaka. Here is where Mitsunari Yoshida and Louis Flores were researching the Genma under Hideyoshi's orders.
there. Ah. Come back! Take a break!
over there! I'll pound you to the ends of the world!
This is... The Dark Stone. This is it, huh? Hideyoshi is absorbing the essence from this stone. This is where his power is coming from. Then this room is made to send all of that power over to Hideyoshi. Right. Exactly. Everyone, back away a little. Not that you could do anything to it anyway. Mitsunari! But how did you find this place? Ah, the Westerner. You told them. I thought you were just another tame lab rat. Why do you insist on defying us? Roberto! The only way to destroy it is with these. Roberto, stop! This is why I live. This is what the power contained in my arms is for. <laughs> His arms, that light. The exercising beads are inside of the Westerner. Fine job, Luis Royce. No wonder Rosencrantz has trouble controlling you. Abbas, Luis Royce's destiny is now my destiny. I won't let your plan succeed. Only humor. Only human. Right. Just give up now. I was at a disadvantage with this body. This one was almost used up anyway. Your little victory has had no effect on our overall plan. Your plan? I have a few questions about your little plan, Mitsunari. <laughs> or should I say Claudius? Oh, to think my real name is being used by a mere human. You are not as foolish as I first thought. You are starting to see things as they really Enough are. Enough empty praise! Answer me! 
fine. This land is filling with darkness, and when the Genma trees blossom, our god will descend from the star. Humanity will be no more, and a new world under the Genma will begin. Yes, our destiny is to revive the Genma God of Light. Everything is going according to plan. The cherry trees, the festival, the dark stones, the foreign war. All of it is your doing? Of course. Never underestimate the awesome power of the Genma. Consider your plan. Scrap! <laughs> Interesting. Well, go ahead and stop me. Show me what one black Oni can do alone. So little time remains until the descent of the light. I have been looking forward to it. <gasps> Claudius, you don't seem to get it. I'm not just one black Oni alone. We were justified in going to the research facility. We got our hands on a lot of useful information. Right! I'm dying to hear! Tell us what you learned. Yes. First, the ones behind the Genma, the Omen Star, the Descent of the Light, and the Genma Mother Tree. Once? Guess that means it isn't Hideyoshi after all. No. The ones behind it all are the Triumvirate. Claudius, Rosencrantz, and Ophelia. Claudius, Rosencrantz, and Ophelia? The Triumvirate are doing all of this to bring their God of Light back and replace the world of man with the world of Genma. So then, what is Hideyoshi? Hideyoshi is probably just being used by the Triumvirate as the vessel for the Light's descent. The vessel? The flesh and blood body their god needs in order to awaken. I get it. So they're just going to put the God of Light into Hideyoshi when the time comes. And his power is merely a side effect of being a vessel for the Light! The timing was just right for them. Just when Hideyoshi was trying to discover how to use the Genma to rule the world, the Triumvirate approached him using the research that was under Mitsunari's lead. Claudius lies within Mitsunari, and Rosencrantz is possessing Papa, Luis Royce. Roberto mentioned Luis's sudden transformation, but now we know that was because a Genma was controlling him. That being said, though, Mitsunari doesn't seem to be suffering any strange effects. Does that mean he wasn't possessed so much as in league with them? Mitsunari Ishida not only brought the Genma back, but sold his soul to them. What an ass. I would say that Mitsunari and Claudius are in league as well, but I doubt that will last. At some point, Claudius will consume Mitsunari's soul entirely. And the other one? O Ophi? Ophi? Ophelia is the one I'm not sure about, but I have no doubt she is somewhere close to Hideyoshi. How about the Dark Stones? What do they do? They're feeding the God of Light, if that makes sense. By the God of Light, I mean the vessel for its coming, Hideyoshi. The Dark Stones absorb the essence from the Genma trees and the Mother Tree. With time, the stones bring the large red star that the Soul of the Light inhabits closer and closer to this world. So, as long as we destroy the Dark Stones and Hideyoshi, we should be able to prevent the Light's descent. Theoretically. Well, Roberto took care of the Dark Stones for us. Not quite. Remember the other one I mentioned. There is another one just like the one we destroyed in the Toyokuni Research Facility in Shimabara, Kyushu. Kyushu's quite far from here! There's not much choice. If we don't destroy it, the star will be guided to our world and bring with it our annihilation when the light takes control of Hideyoshi. That is what Claudius is planning. We can't let them get away with it. Shimabara, huh?
If we destroy the Dark Stone in Shimabara, we might still have some hope left. There's not much choice for us but to go there. But how will we get there? All of the ships were destroyed in the invasion. Run! And just how are we supposed to make it all the way over to Kyushu before the star descends? If a ship is what you want, a ship is what you will have. There is one ship that is not being used for the invasion. The San Felipe, I presume? Perfect! We have a boat. Let's go! The port of Sakai it is, then. Arin, we're going to Kyushu. Thank you for all you've done for us. We are in your debt. We'll be there and back in no time. All right. I'll be waiting. They've grown so much. That sound. I'm leaving it to you. Come back! Gotcha! You're finished! There! Stay over there! You're finished! Come back! Over there!
Jube. Over there! Come back! Ah. Stay over there!
stay on guard. Right.
Over there! Ah.
Is that it? No mistaking it. That's the San Felipe. Something very dangerous. about us. Tenkai, you're back. Yeah, he'll spat me back out. Spat you back out? It's not important now. Oh. 
Right. It's time to expel the darkness. You just came back from the other side. Need a little help? Soki, show me the power of the Onimusha. It would appear they know about Shima Bara. It is all part of the plan. His plan. Ah, yes. He has not yet given up on the power of the Black Pony. It would appear so, anyway. Have you heard from Ophelia? She, she has already made preparations at Hinzen. <laughs> Impetuous fools. I am sure she must be quite eager to greet her new guests. I, I am sure she would make them feel welcome. Rosencrantz, we must hurry to Shimabara and prepare for our friends. The Oni will have a nice surprise waiting for them. Understood. Uh, uh, what of Sakon? Leave him. He has failed for the last time. Too bad. He would have made a great subject for my research. <laughs> to go. You're quite the handyman, Soki. It's almost like you've worked on ships before. I've ridden on my fair share. The invasion is still going on to this day. While we stand here, countless people are being slaughtered. Soki. Don't you have better things to do? Black Oni. Don't underestimate your power. Stop speaking in riddles! Black Oni, we are two polar opposites, you and I. What the hell are you... Huh? Soki, something wrong? Tenkai, is something there? Can you see something? Very faintly. Be careful. You sense something is not right about his presence. State your business.
Stay true. Has the time come to move out? How far out at sea are we? This is taking forever. We've already made too many stops with the ship getting damaged, and the weather not favoring our journey. The Genma attacked us too. Either way, it is safer than the land route. Yeah, and this whole boat ride is a blast! I wish we could be out here longer. I'm loving it! You are enjoying this far too much. Land! We are fast approaching Beppu Bay in Kyushu. down uh -huh. let's go I was just getting bored. Come on. Stay over there. Care of it. Take them down, huh?
Come back! Uh huh. You're finished! You're finished! Stay over there! The power of nature! Take care of it! Over there! <gasps> you have traveled a long way to die here, Oni. Oh no! Not you too! Most likely. But something's wrong. I sense the aura of death around her. She must be. What are you insinuating, foul Oni? I am the royal concubine. No one controls me. <laughs> Let's do this! Right. Oh, Hatsu, you are not going to let them kill me, are you? Your own sister? I thought you loved me. How can you let this happen right in front of your own eyes? <gasps> no! Stop! Don't kill her! Oh, Hatsu! That's not Yodo! It's just a spirit what? possessing the dead. Just... leave her alone! Fine. Your stupidity knows no bounds.
<laughs> oh, Hatsu. That was nothing. Don't worry about it. Oh, Hatsu. This isn't the time for tears. Here they come.
It's okay. I'm sure she's fine. We're finally here. It's taken quite a bit of time. The Toyokuni Research Facility stands in front of us. I sense a strong presence of evil gathering here. The enemy is prepared for our arrival. Bring them on. We'll just have to be prepared for them. Roberto. Oh. Oh, Hatsu. Why are you sitting here alone? Where are the others? They're all relaxing over there. I think they must be exhausted. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want to be alone? No. Not at all. I was just remembering some old friends. You grew up here, didn't you? Yes, I did. The research facility is like my home. Luis Frois was like the father I never had, because my real one died in the war. It must be difficult to have to attack your old home. It is. I promised myself that I would destroy Luis, but I feel confused. That's just being human. Of course you are. That's the Roberto I like. Don't say words like like or love so easily. Save it for the most important man in your life. Most important? Soki. What are you... But, but, but he's just... <laughs> Sorry. You are too innocent. It's hard to resist kidding with you. Is it? <laughs> you laughed. That's the first time I've heard it. Uh, yeah. We should head back. You need your rest. You're right. I'll head back now. You should get some rest too. I will. Mis pensamientos nunca llegarán. arrived in Shimabara. I feel a chill in the air. I feel it too. Something's wrong. The seal of the Genma is broken. And we stand in front of the place generating the dark essence, filling Japan with its evil. This is the source of Hideyoshi's power. If we can just destroy it, then... We might be able to destroy Hideyoshi as well. Taking down with it the Triumvirate's plans. Don't think too far forward. We still have powerful enemies ahead of us. But this will be a decisive battle. Then let's go! Ready? Always! We can't look back. We must continue on!
stay up. Take care of it. Stay over there. Take care of it. Stay over there. Take care of it! Feel the power of nature!
the souls.
there. Just getting bored. Come on.
over there. Come back! You're both here. 
Claudius. Where's the Dark Stone? Oh, that. Great. How are we going to get up there? <laughs> you have had a long journey, Oni. But it ends now! Power of the Genma. 
The Westerner cannot even move, let alone destroy the Dark Stone. With the stone still intact, I am invincible. What now, Ray? Only. Sakon, what are you doing here? Oh, spirit! Leave my master's body!
failed! Only seven more days until the star arrives. You have achieved but a small victory by destroying the stone. But how will you reach Kyoto to fight the ocean? It would seem to me that you have failed! <laughs> Dark stones are no more. Hideyoshi's unlimited power supply is cut off at the source. We only have seven more days until the star descends. We have to return to Kyoto and stop Hideyoshi before that happens. But how are we supposed to get there from here so quickly? It's not possible. There has got to be a way. There is a way. Go to Nagoya Castle in Hizen. Nagoya Castle? The launching point for the invasion of the mainland. Exactly. Hideyoshi kept a transportation device in the keep. If you use it, you can travel instantly to Kyoto. If we hurry, it is only four days to Nagoya Castle from here. Oh. All hope is not lost! Yeah. Huh. It might as well be. How will you assault Nagoya Castle with just five people? Nagoya Castle served as the final staging point for the invasion of the mainland. It's designed to be an impregnable fortress. Final staging point? I've been here once before, when they sent me to fight in that hell over there. That hell is still going on. And it'll keep going on until Hideyoshi is stopped. Not only Japan, but every human being living on this planet will feel the wrath of the Genna and the tragedy that has fallen on the mainland. Once Hideyoshi is gone, there will be no need for soldiers to go over and fight. Then let's make our way inside. We will use the staging point for the war to end it. We will prevent the descent of the light and wipe the Genma from this world. This world has already seen enough tragedy. Let's head to Kyoto and end it. Hideyoshi, your time is almost over. I'm ready to move out. device in the castle. This won't be easy. Think of it as good preparation for the final showdown with Hideyoshi. We'll make it. Friends. Father. Give me your strength. Grandfather. I won't let you down.
Only two days remain until the descent of the Omen Star. There is only one way to reach Hideyoshi in time to defeat him. They must use the transportation device at Nagoya Castle in Hizen. Sophie and the others break into Nagoya Castle and make their way towards humanity's last hope. The Stay space over there! Order. Understood.
Take care of it! You're finished! Over there! Take care of it! the power of nature! Go! <laughs> 
stay over there. Take care of it. Over there!
over there. there. hard woman to get rid of. You must be looking forward to killing me. Well, your grandfather is anyway. Uncle! <laughs> I have something to tell you about grandfather <laughs> and your eye. I don't want to hear about the man who killed my mother. He told me to never reveal the truth, but you're wrong! Come now. He dug my eye out and replaced it with my mother's, his own wife's. Any man who would rip out his own wife's eye is beneath even the Genma! That's not true! You lost your eye in an accident. Grandmother gave her own eye to you in order to save your life! <laughs> nice try. I'm not lying. Uncle! How, how could that be? Impossible. <laughs> no. Then this, this whole time, I've been such a fool! No! <laughs> ha! <laughs> Who 
cares about such a trivial thing? <laughs> you call that trivial? Uncle! I didn't come this far just to walk away because some little event in my past changed on me. You! You were loved! And this is how you repay it? <laughs> oh, save your breath, Akane. You'll need it. You really are just a twisted, evil bastard. Death is the only way you will learn. Munanori Yagyu! that Hideyoshi has created on this world from down in your new home. Bye-bye. <laughs> Starting its final descent. Uh, damn it. Oh, to hell! Isn't there something we can do? All of our efforts will be wasted! There is one other way. Mirokichi! Lord Mitsuhide Akechi's tomb in Kyoto. The Akechi tomb? Exactly! With that device and the power that's been granted to me, I can send everyone to it! Where did you learn such a neat trick? When we were at the Akechi tomb, Lord Mitsuhide spoke to me. 
He gave me this power for precisely this moment. We don't have much time. Hold on. What's going to happen to you when you do that? There's no time. You know, Kichi? Father, with this, I have finally become a warrior. Haven't I? Tenkai? Is Minokichi... gone? <laughs> Jubei, where are you going? He's in. Where do you think I'm going? I'm going back to Minokichi! Then what? We can't waste the time he gave us. What do you mean, waste? You've been together for so long! He was your friend! Do you even care about him? <laughs> How can you be so cold? I do care about him! <laughs> Soki! Jubei! Stop it! Jubei... Everyone feels the same here. If any of us could go back, we would. But think... Why are we here? Why did he give his life to send us here? He was a brave little warrior. Damn fool. We never would have made it back here in time if it weren't for him. He gave us hope when hope was lost. We must hurry to Fushimi Castle. We must destroy Hideyoshi and save the land. That's what Minokichi would have wanted. Minokichi! We have lost another companion. How many of those we care about must die in this war? We will end it. Kaede. We don't have time for grieving. We must hurry.
I'm ready to move out. That wind is blowing from the Omen Star. It's too cold for this time of year. My demon eye is reacting to it. It carries evil in its wake. We must continue forward in memory of the Fallen. The Omen Star must be stopped. We are coming for your head, Hideyoshi. Must win. It is not just our own lives at stake. Failure will bring about the end of humanity. We must destroy Hideyoshi. Care of it. Understood. You're finished. Damn. Stay over there. Understood. You're finished.
by the dark essence from the Omen Star? You're pathetic, Rosencrantz. I'll take care of him. Roberto! Go, Soki. There's not much time left until the Omen Star touches down. We'll leave him to you.
Claudius. He was revived too. Keep going! Time's almost up! Tenkai! Soki, you're humanity's last hope. It's all up to you now. Tenkai! You're okay, right? Yeah, I'll be fine. You've been a thorn in my side for too long now, Claudius. It's time for the line of Genma to end here. Once and for all! Okay? There should be a shortcut to Fushimi somewhere over here. No! Ohatsu! I just remembered there's something I have to do. Oh. Jubei, what is it? No, don't worry about me. Just keep going. I'll catch up. Jubei. Finish what you left your village to do. Yes. I will end this. <clears throat> Go! You're the one that was chosen to save humanity. Don't waste time standing around here. Promise me. You'll catch up with us later. Of course I will. Anyway, don't worry about me. better than to come between them. Well, now there's no one to interfere. Let's finish this once and for all. <laughs> How did you know I was here? <laughs> you seem well after the we gave you? I'm guessing you had a Genma bug snack. Yes. I'm quite full now. <laughs> You're a member of the Oni clan. How could you side with the Genma? Akane, right now, I'm feeling wonderful. <laughs> the Oni and Genma blood have combined within my body. <laughs> The Oni and Genma aren't really that far apart when you think about it. <laughs> I feel fantastic. The power of the Genma is unbelievable. I've come a long way for you. It's time to end my journey. Grandfather, everyone, lend me your strength. I am Akane of the Yagyu! Oh, 
Atsu! Saki, go! Oh, Atsu! I'll keep her occupied. Just stop Hideyoshi. Saki, the path leading to Hideyoshi is the one that everyone helped to build. Jubei, Tenkai, Roberto, they all risked their lives to create it. Now I am completing it for you. Hideyasu, there's no time to lose. If you don't stop him, everyone's life will be in vain. Only you can put an end to Hideyoshi's evil plans. You are humanity's last hope. Don't worry about me. It's our destiny to be together. So don't let me down. Where are you going? Oh. Oh. Suki, go! hand on him. Oh. Foolish girl! Oh. Ophelia, I'm not the same girl anymore. Grotesque hag. You think you can beat me alone? We will defeat you!
one has fallen without realizing his final hope. One has fallen clinging to his faith. One has fallen leaving the fate of the future to his companions. History is riddled with the waves of destruction and rebirth. These waves roll onward far into the future. Much has been destroyed. Many have perished.
Not yet.
should I do? Yeah! <laughs>
in your attempts to interrupt my festival. Foolish. Truly foolish. That's the Genma Mother Tree? It's behind this living hell the world has turned into. I will burn it and cut you down with my blade. You think that just because you sealed away the dark stones that you can defeat me? Pitiful. My source of power remains unlimited, even after your little journey. So long as I have this! Look closely! It is the seed for the God of Light's rebirth! Seed? <laughs> the star is almost here. When it arrives, I will be reborn as a god! And you will be the first sacrifice, Black Oni. I am the god that will issue forth a new age! God or not, I will finish you here and now, Hideyoshi! Your precious dreams are about to come to an end! Alive in there! Ugh. 
I told you I'd catch up, Blue. <sighs> Jube!
Is it over? Yes. Chacha! Stay with us! Stay with us! Ohatsu? Chacha! My lord? My lord! Ever since Lord Nobunaga's passing, I have been trapped in a dream. Hideyasu, thank you for undoing my wrongs. I never understood my country or my people. Nothing. I thought I was a god, but I was nothing compared to Lord Nobunaga. <laughs> the Genma pulled my strings and used my lust for power to turn me into the pathetic wretch I became. The do falls and fades, so do I. My life is nothing but a succession of dreams. In the end, when my body lies in the ground, it will disperse like the morning dew. And in the end, my dream is nothing more than a dream. Father, you called me father, Hideyasu. If you can find it in your heart to forgive me, Hideyori, your brother, It's over. What's that? Let's go! is finally mine!
away. Use the Oni Gauntlet. It has the power of the Genma Lord sealed within it. There's no time. Fortinbras has almost been reincarnated. What do I do now? Everyone, give your power to the Gauntlet. The power of the Black Oni, combined with the sealed Genma Lord's power. It would be unimaginable. We just might emerge victorious. Soki. The power of the Black Oni is the power of the God of Darkness. You are the only one strong enough to control it. Take your companion's power. We're with you, Blue. My place is by your side. I will always be with you. Even if the gods stand before you, slay them with the power of the Oni. Our future is in your hands, Soki, Oni of the Ash!
finally. You won. Yes. We did. It's hard to believe. It's over. This is the end of our journey. What's happening? Before me! Die, Fortin Brass! Yes. I am Fortinbras. <laughs> Do not try to fight me. Not with your pitiful Oni power. This is the power of the light? The power of a god? This is far beyond us! It would appear your only choice is to give up everything. Your victory, your future, your lives, everything. I am feeling generous, though. There is one way I will let you live. Bow before me, the all-powerful god of life, and call my name. O oh, Black Oni, great champion of the god of darkness, kneel before the white serpent. <laughs> Your name? Fine. I'll call your name. You are... Evil! You are no god. You're just a worthless sack of shit! I will not bow! Hideous! Unbelievable! 
certainly. What wonderful pride. Do you feel like a great Oni now? Or perhaps a noble samurai? Because I'm human! <laughs> Laughable. You have no gauntlet, no sword. You cannot even stand on your own two feet. Why fight the inevitable? <laughs> I can stand. You have no weapon. What are you going to do? But I do. Hmm. Powerful weapons. I won't pretend to understand your nonsense. Anyway... The time has come at last! You will not live defying the will of a god. Take care of it! Understood. Mere humans can do nothing against me. Feel the power of the enemy! can do nothing against me. Stay over there! Feel the power building in me! Take care of it! Down. 
Take care of it! Understood. Live defying the will of a god. Stay over there. Feel the power building in me! Take care of it! I am the god. 
God of Light! <laughs> Feel the power building in me!
strength! Your powerful weapon! Such a powerful weapon! Evil can never understand it. The weapon that we humans have, our last and greatest weapon is... Faith! Oh, that's nonsense! Whether a black only or a human, you are a fool to the end. You did it, Blue. No, we did it. Together. <sighs> but it's not over. There is something that still needs to be done. I must go. Go? Go where? What are you doing? Why does it have to be you? It's over! Stop talking about destiny! And stop trying to bear the burden alone! You... and the others... have always been by my side. Why?! You've already done more than enough! Leave it to someone else! I don't understand why! Why? Why does it always have to be you? Because... It's the path I have chosen. No, you can't. What? Blue is going to leave. Wake up. Wake up! You think real cherry blossoms will bloom again next year? What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> One last thing to ask of you. When you see the blossoms again, the real ones, every now and again, please try to remember me. What is it? I can't hear you! You damn fool! What are you saying?
Hideyasu. is how the curtain closed on our long journey. I wonder how many tomorrows are left for us. Ohatsu was sad, and wouldn't stop crying at first. But one day she decided it was time to let go of the past. So she married a man from a noble Kyoto household. She kept watch over Yoro's son, the Toyotomi heir, and seemed content. But I'm sure that somewhere deep in her heart, even now, Once Ohatsu's marriage was decided, Roberto set off on a voyage back to his homeland, España. He vowed never to allow his country to make the same mistake of helping the Genma again. He couldn't shake the feeling that his own country's hand in the events was his responsibility. Roberto will find a new battle waiting for him when he gets home. Even if his opponent is the king of España himself, I doubt he'll hold back any punches. Finally, there's Tenkai. He looked ready to live out his remaining days in peace with Arin, but he still had the gauntlet to seal. Arin refused to let him go on his own, and seemed to enjoy the idea of sharing the journey together. Oh yeah, something strange happened. When Tenkai was alone with Arin, he kept calling her Akko for some reason. Arin also called Tenkai by something else. What was it? Sa... Sama... Oh, I forget. to see grandfather again but I heard rumors that someone was still alive I set out on my journey again but this time I am not alone
I wonder how many tomorrows have come and gone since that day. Will my journey ever end? Trees that you saved. Now it's my turn to protect them. 